true. We don't get the best, and we don't get the you know the most expensive. Yeah, we I wonder get out west. Crappy I mean, one they send us. I wonder out west, California, Washington, Oregon, if they have like a Oregon. certain kind. Yeah, they got a certain kind that's made out up in Washington or something. You know, it's yeah. like upside Seattle, down eggnog. Seattle Chad Zone eggnog or whatever. Yeah, it's woke. Woke eggnog. <laughs> You, they didn't use real eggs in theirs. Yeah. Or cream. <laughs> they, they, uh, they, it's uh, right. with coconut milk. Not, and, not the, I'm trying to think. It's not the flag planting thing, but what's the other word where you, like when the cops take your car, I need your car for you know, going after these crooks. Uh, what's that called? Commandeer. Uh, commandeer. Yeah, they probably commandeered the chicken farm to get those eggs and. Oh, no, no, they can't use eggs because that would be uh, cruel to the animals. Uh, some of them are meat no, eaters. You can't use the eggs. That's uh, that's not even vegetarian. That's, you know, that's meat. You got to do a tofu and bean curd, coconut milk, eggnog. Yeah. Oh, that's right, because some of them are part of PETA, right? <laughs> Don't get me started on PETA. PETA is one of the worst organizations out there for animals. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I thought they loved animals. They loved to kill them. I thought PETA was the one that was trying to save them. They actually kill more animals than they save. Oh, really? Yeah. It's horrible. You look into it, you see the statistics on it and everything, and it's like they kill more animals than they save. I thought they were the most money they, they raise, the majority of that money goes to pay people. Probably the CEO. And, yeah. yeah, in the positions and everything. It's just crazy. I mean, I don't... I don't All mind organizations. organizations fighting for animals. I don't mind even people being woke to a degree where they, you know, are, are more conscientious with with how they, uh, with their food, you know, and animals yeah. and how they treat animals and whether they use animals as food or whatever, or for byproducts of, of food byproducts, you know, yeah. all that stuff. I don't care about all that stuff. That's you. You do you, you know, that's fine. But man, uh, you start taking money, portraying yourselves as a savior of animals and everything like that. Oh yeah, yeah. Awesome. And then you you get people to buy into it and believe it, and you can't convince them otherwise. Right. Even if the but, figures were right there in front of them, there's a lot of people who would not believe it. Right. Oh well, yeah, there's a whole bunch of people on that side. Why well, must probably get in trouble know, for saying that one? You know what? There's animals every day are killed. Mm -hmm. Even just roadkill. Look at all the raccoons. Well, in California, squirrels. they're going to allow people to be able to uh, technically uh, take the roadkill and eat it now. Oh. All you have to do is call in and say, hey, uh, the animal was just killed by a car, da 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 da, and uh, this is the animal, da da da, and I'm taking it. Really? And they allow you to, even if it's a deer or whatever now. So. But most people wouldn't call anyhow, they just pick it up and take it. Here yes, but what? you can get arrested for it later if they say, "Hey, what what, what you doing with that deer?" Oh, and, I hit it back there, and uh, oh no, no, no. Uh -uh. How many people get caught doing that? Not many. I'm just saying that's what they are starting to do now. Yeah, because I, I know that one guy used to work at a juice plant we worked at, and uh, some weird dude. He's like, "You he get me? Uh, I had armadillo. Give me armadillo one time. Tastes like chicken." I ran over a turtle. He was like, oh, was it a gopher? I was like, no, it was a turtle. He was like, no, was it a gopher turtle? It was a type of turtle. I'm like, I don't know what the hell kind of... Next time you run over a turtle, bring it, scoop that up and bring it in. And then he also... I got hog head cheese for the first time. Yeah, that guy was crazy. <laughs> you were crazy. You were eating yeah. the stuff he was making. I know. <laughs> yeah, I try anything once. Twice if I like it, yeah. Is that the same guy that brought in the frog legs? I don't know. He worked in the barrel room. He's an older guy. By the time I left there, he was gone. He, he didn't. He wasn't there. Uh, the one guy that uh, I knew worked up in uh, the control room. As oh no, he, no, he didn't work in the control room. I think I know who you're talking about there, though. He brought in uh, uh, frog legs, fried frog legs. Tastes like greasy chicken. Ugh. Yeah. And my nephew had frog legs once. We were going up to New York and. Uh, through Car Carolina, we stopped at a restaurant. I had frog legs. He said, I'm going to try frog legs. And got to the hotel. He was yakking all night. <laughs> you know what's so it, funny is, is that they went gigging and all that stuff. And so he brought this, these frog legs in. 
And I said, what you got there? And he goes, I've got frog legs. And he thought he was being smart. He thought it was going to bother me or whatever like that. And I'm like, yeah, you go, go ahead and have some. I looked at it and I grabbed a piece. Yeah, that's not too bad. It tastes like a greasy chicken. Yeah. I never had it, but and that's what it tastes like to me. <laughs> and then I grabbed another one and had another. <laughs> and he's looking at me all shocked that I ate it. Yeah, I'm not it's, big on eating amphibians or lizards or reptiles nah, or anything. Get over it. That's one of the few things of the uh, the commandments that I follow. Yeah. Thou right. shalt not eat any amphibian creature or whatever. All right, so you don't eat fish, huh? No, no, amphibians like land and lives on land and water. There's some walking fish. <laughs> yeah, but how many walking fish are there? Hey, there's some flying fish too. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. There's hey, there's swimming birds. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, what a strange world. <laughs> you're gonna have a yard bird or the yard bird? Yeah, yard bird. I mean, you look at turkeys. I mean, uh, you don't really see them fly very much. Right. They flop. They might go airborne a little bit. Don't get me wrong. Chickens Chickens and turkeys, they can clear a uh, a barn, a two story barn, you know. Right. If they really. Especially those wild chickens down there, because they go up on roofs and up in trees. I mean, if they really want to, they can do it, but uh, they have to be inspired. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Get a dog chasing them or something. Yeah. Yeah, we went on for 25 minutes, about nothing. (laughs) Hey, maybe I could delete, edit it later and turn it into a... Drinking and thinking. Drinking and thinking. All right. (laughs) Birds, birds, it's like the islands of Mr. Toys. A bird that swims and I'm a fish that flies. (laughs) And a a bird that walks. (laughs) And a fish that walks. (laughs) Look at a hippo. Uh, A land creature. But it's they in the swim. water. And they swim pretty fast, too. Yeah, for being that big. Like, and, uh, they're like uh, water pigs. I mean, they, it's like a fast, giant, fast-swimming pig. Yeah. That can kill you. Yeah. I mean, you ever seen the video with the guys on a boat and the thing's coming and you just see the waves of it coming? And it's like oh, all yeah. ass. I was like. They move quick for their weight. Yeah. I don't, I don't know how they swim so well. Maybe because they got flat feet and they just. It's all that fat, man. They just float. Yeah. What's propelling them though? How are they propelling themselves? Their feet, those big old feet moving. Well, they're flat, so they're catching all the water to push yeah. back. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Plus, their tail propels like a. Yeah, that'd be funny. Actually. <laughs> it's, it's like a, a thermal thrust that, you know, hung, you ever played a game Hungry Hippo? Yeah. Well, their, their mouth opens wide. Water all goes in and just flushes throughout their, their ass end and just jet stream. Them forward. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I'm Shag Dog. Yeah. Spitter Swallow Beer Reviews.